One piece of advice I'd give to anybody still young trying to figure out what they want to do is to know that it's okay to do things that don't seem cool at the time. When I was young, math, being good at math was kind of okay. You know, I had good friends who, some of them liked math, some of them hated math, but if I liked it, that was all that mattered, you know? If I enjoyed it, it was fine, and nobody called me a nerd. I think I was worried they would, but people didn't really call me a nerd because people like it when they can tell you're enjoying something or when you're smart. I think the older you get, being smart does become cool, you know? People really start to say, oh, that's neat that you can figure that out. And I think the more you persist in things like that, it really starts to shine the older you get. As you go into high school, you go into college, you really start to thrive if you stick around with something that you find interesting. So I think that's one piece of advice I'd give. If you love art, really throw yourself into it. Learn as much as you can, make weird sculptures. That's actually kind of another piece of advice I'd give is, it's good to play by the rules, but it's also okay to kind of push them around a little bit. Um, I remember in art, I always liked doing the project that they asked me to do, but then also trying to make it three-dimensional in some way. I remember this one time I made a watercolor painting of fish under the sea. And I thought it was really cool, but one of my favorite books growing up was this book called, I think it was Rainbow Fish, where there's this fish with really pretty scales. And so I found a bunch of old little beads, craft beads, and I made one of the fish have three-dimensional, kind of beautifully beaded scales. You know, and I just kind of like pushing around the rules a little bit. Same thing, if you like math, that's great, but you can, you can use math in all sorts of ways, you know, just find a good mentor, and uh, I'll bet you'll find really creative ways to use it.